What? Oh. You're explaining. Well, it's not started yet. Oh, yes, it did. Well, it, it didn't start yet. It. It's still starting. Are we good? There we go. Uh, okay, that's yeah. I like how I duck down <laughs> so everyone know uh, knows how fun and childish you are. What? <laughs> yeah, I resemble that statement. You mean you resent that statement? Resemble. I know exactly what I said. <laughs> okay, all right. I said what I meant. I meant what I said. Uh huh. All right. Hi, what are everyone. we doing? Explain to us, um, Professor. So, yes. So I've been tired of cooking for the whole family. No, I mean, I have a lot of fun with it. Um, but to make life easier for our crazy family of five, we decided to try out Blue Apron. Easier. Easier, yes. Um, this is not a sponsored post, just so everyone knows. Uh, we just decided to try it. And uh, I've never done an unboxing video, but what's better than food and unboxing something? Ooh, so we tried this thing, the Blue Apron. Yeah. All right. I don't have a blue apron, but I do get my red undies on. Okay. I, I didn't, <laughs> nobody needs to know about the color of your underwear. Why not? Wait, what do if you, I want to jump in the bait tank? Do you guys want to know about the color of his underwear? I don't yeah, think yeah, so. Yeah. No, um, there those ones. Remember that episode when I jumped in the, uh, under the boat? The striped ones? The infamous striped red ones? Do you want to see? No. All right. No, I'm good. <laughs> All right. All right. So here we go. So we're gonna unbox this and see what's in store. So what did you what did you order, Jill? What did what do we get well, to expect? There was a because you get to pick, right? Yeah, there was four different meal options, um, and I decided that meal options we like pasta. Um, so we're gonna try with the pasta. Um, so it comes with, I there guess, yeah, my friends. Instructions or those instru directions. Okay. So yeah, there's two two different recipes and instructions here, which makes it nice and easy. Um, Kind of nice. Ooh. Yeah. Looks like it's packaged pretty well. Yeah, it's like that. Christmas. Yeah. Almost. And what? <laughs> yes, there's a vegetable in there. It's all green. I think it's spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> no, so we got zucchinis. Oh uh, yeah, so the, I guess the two recipes here. We have one recipe for some hot honey chicken with rosemary and um, ch chipoline onion panzella, panzanella, sorry about that. And then we have another recipe for cheesy pesto baked cavatelli with zucchini and mushrooms. Right, so those are our... She was the old lady who used to make subs at, you know, the 7-Eleven, well, back when it was White Hen Pantry. Yeah. Rosemary. Okay. All right. Anyway. It's helpful information. So we have a fresh cavatelli pasta. Looks like it's homemade. You got cool. the shrooms, man. <laughs> Lots of mushrooms. mushrooms. We have mozzarella cheese, a cheese packet, some mm -hmm. grated cheese. I just want to give a sneak so, peek so, of yeah. what it looks like. So yeah, it's packaged pretty nice. It's got the nice bubble wrap. Actually, it's not the nice bubble wrap. It doesn't pop. <laughs> so that's kind of lame. Yeah, oh, yeah. there it goes. Okay. All right, all right. That's a, nobody needs... To see that garlic now we're gonna have to add to that that's totally that's sufficient amount of garlic definitely not enough garlic at least like six more of those well that's barely the size of the head of my nope tuna um i'm gonna read the comments here ah uh, i think it's spoiled no oh, no it's spinach <laughs> it's just naturally green tomatoes great tomatoes Oh, those are good. I like those. Grape tomatoes. I'm done with that. And then, Hopefully. so this must be one meal. And this is a honey chicken spices or some such a thing. I mean, some things. So then we got sandwich rolls. Nice. And then there's another layer. And then, what do we got here? Okay, so there's two packets. And here's the chicken breast. So you get the chicken breast. So That's this cool. is two meals. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna have to add. Did you know your brother like would eat this <laughs> in one setting, both yeah. meals? 
We're going to have to add because it's only uh, about four people, right. uh, a meal for four. Right. Um, but this was just an experimental um, deal to see what this uh, was like. Lori asked if the box chilled. Yes, the box is chilled. They're these two oh. giant ice um, packets that it came packed in. It's more recyclable. One, one on the top, one on the bottom. There seems to be no leakage. It's dry. And we got, there was nice bubble wrap that it was packed in. And all the food produce seems very cold as well. You put your hands on it, it's cold to the top. So everything yeah, freshness wise seems in order. And I see nothing that makes me nervous except the green vegetables. But I don't believe that has to do with quality. Mm -hmm. So these two of these nice gel packs. And we'll actually recycle these. And when I, we send our clients home with fish from the boat, we'll have a nice ice pack to put in their fillets. Maybe even save this box too if people want to ship it. There you go. Oh, it looks like in the miscellaneous bag there's some olives, some rosemary, some mayonnaise, some onions. Mayonnaise. It's like a nice little assortment. Yeah, I get a story uh, about mayonnaise. I don't think I Ask Jay. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, so that's it. Now, I guess, we're going to cook it. Now, we're not going to bore you with the cooking procedure because we fumble through that. But when we do get it prepared, we'll log back on and give you a little um, a little taste preview. So I vote we make both meals because one of these just isn't going to be enough. We're, we're going to make one. We're going to make two. <laughs> we're going to make one. We're going to make two. Uh -huh. Okay. Well, let's um, do it the democratic way. I'm the captain and the daddy. So what I say is goes. Uh, There's okay. not enough here for five people. But well, we do I'm that. Kidding. We're not yeah. complaining. It's not a complaint, mind you, but there were small meals. It's great because we were thinking, too, like this might come in handy when we're fishing on the boat to get these, you know, pre prep meals. And that way we just have to throw them together on the boat. So we, we wanted to try it mm -hmm. pretty much for that reason. And pretty much like the rest of you, you know, with this quarantine going on, we're all bored and we're experimenting with different things. And uh, Jell's been doing a great job coming up with a lot of recipes from scratch, mm -hmm. as well as we have the family recipes. But we have, you know, experimented with new stuff and, and we've had both kinds of results. We've had some really good stuff that will probably continue to be part of the family traditions. And we had some stuff that only Jell eats. Yeah, and I haven't even made Beans. them lentils what was that yet. Bean one. I don't know. I wasn't big on that. Yeah, it's the lentils. <laughs> um, but there it is. So when these are cooked, we're going to log back on and we'll give you a test result. Yeah. And again, once again, the, the company was that Blue Apron. Mm -hmm. How was the price structure, Jell? Reasonable, uh, I don't know. But this fair. is a we free. This is a free box from somebody's oh, so friend. Oh, so okay. Promotional for somebody's, deal. Somebody's my my friend's parents do it, so they oh, said right. that they'd send us a free oh, okay. box, or because you can sign up for a free box with somebody. Well, you know what they say it, about so. free. If it's free, it's for me. Oh yeah, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> no, but we will give my uh, we'll give we'll give it a try because again, I was interested. I was like, this might be helpful fishing, just so we can have prep meals when we go and all we got to do is on the boat throw them together nice and easy this way we e don't... easy peasy lemon squeezy this way we don't have to fight the cameraman for their food that's right <laughs> <laughs> all right very well, good we'll see you guys later we'll give you a quick review of the taste once we get it all prepared ciao Maine.